Holy cow. Literally. <laughs> Hi guys. So I am in Fond du Lac County and we're doing another rustic road. It's pretty close to central Wisconsin, just by, uh, south of Lake Michigan, um, off of 41. So I am headed to like the Lamira area, I guess. And we're gonna go do the rustic road there. I think it's 82. I think it's 82. I don't know, I can't keep track of them all. So if you are new to this channel, I am creating this personal challenge of mine, I guess. So I want to complete all of the 120 Wisconsin Rustic Roads in Wisconsin. So that means I'm going to ride every single one of them from start to end. Um, I don't think I can do them all this year. That would be awesome if I could but I just don't have the time to do it. So whenever I do, like today, I am going to kind of slowly chip away at each one of these. So I am going to try to find the start of that road here shortly. I guess it's in seven miles. And yeah, I'll take you guys along for the ride. So I am on Rustic Road 28. Ah, geez, am I dyslexic? Oh my god, dicks dyslexic. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. All right, so I am on Rustic Road 82 here in Fond du Lac County, and we gotta get this picture. Whoops, I'm flipping it around to make sure we've got proof that we were here. So I always had to take these. Can't do two things at once, so I gotta smile and do this at the same time. So you have to have proof that you rode the rustic road. And by doing that, you either take a picture of the sign and the bike, or yourself the bike and the sign together, whatever it may be. I do both, just so we have it. And this is in Lamira, Wisconsin. It's, sorry, just under 10 miles. Um, so yeah, let's get rolling here once I get my gloves back on. Turn you on too. All right, ready? Let's go. Whew. It's nice when you're riding, but Ugh. when you're sitting stagnant, it's getting warm. So this is the only rustic road in Fond du Lac County. And honestly, I just haven't had the chance to ride it before, even though it's close by-ish. Um, it's still a little bit out of the way off of 41, Highway 41, so haven't really had the chance to do it. So we're going to complete it today. I love how everybody gives you waves when you're going by. Um, this is on the way here too and it's just a gentleman walking on the road just waving hi i don't know if it's hey hope you see me don't run me over or if it's just a hello friendly wave i'm not sure everything is turning so green right now it's awesome to see feels like just like two weeks ago there were barely any green leaves on the trees and now it's just full-blown luscious green. I have missed this weather. I've missed this time of year. Oh, this is fun. Woo! Holy cow. Literally. <laughs> um, these are really fun. I would not want to run this. But riding a bike on this, this is super cool. Some big ass hills. I love, love, love seeing all these farms that are still, still going. Yeah, come on bike. Oh geez, I think I'm in fifth gear. Come on. <laughs> Go. 
Y'all, this is super, super cool. I feel like I'm on top of the world right now. Oh yeah, I'm totally in fifth gear. Wow, that took some effort to get up. Still super cool. Was not expecting these hills. Oh, and that's the end of it already? There's no way. That was not nine miles. All right, I'm gonna pause. Ugh. Take out my phone. Now I'm understanding. So we just did the straight line here. Apparently there's all of this as well. Interesting. Okay, so should I turn around and do that stretch or just do the next one up and over and all that? I like when they're just straight routes because then they start and end, but then they start and end and then they turn and... All right, we'll just go straight. I'll put you back on here so that way if I need you, I can reference you. And... Oh try to do the rest of this rustic road. I was like, there was no way, no way that was nine miles. It was super fun though, that first part. So incredible, really high hills. Do, 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 do. So this part, I guess, is not part of the rustic road. If I would have turned around, taken that road wherever it was, then I would still be on it. Like I said, the signs for some of these are pretty hard to catch, but you gotta really look out for them. So see the brown and yellow rustic road. We're gonna go back over this direction and see where this part takes you to. All right, so we're still on Rustic Road 82. So this one goes south, north, north and south um, as well, but then the, I think like the next road to either the right or the left will take you in the last portion of the Rustic Road. So let's see if they can provide me a sign. And if not, it's a good thing I have my Google map to tell me where I'm going. All right, so this was part of it. This road here, Cloverland. Interesting. Okay. So that one told you which direction it could go. The other one did not. Ugh. Definitely not the worst rustic roads I've ridden, but still pretty cool. All right, turn here. Holy cow, that was quick. Okay, ooh, fun, 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 fun. So we're on Spring Drive now. I'm just gonna forego the, oops, forego the rest of that road so I can ride the longer portion here and then I'll turn back around and come back down this way. So it's kind of zigzagging through the rustic road. Up the hill! This is super fun. I have to say it's probably in my top 10 favorites so far. I've only ridden, what is it? What's my count up to right now? 15? 15 of the roads? But this one is super cool. If you know like the actual route to do. So granted, of course, this is like my first time doing this. I don't know exact route, but now that I do, these are so fun. Like, lovely smell of cow manure. Hello, friends. Urgh. That's fun. I hate that they're eating out of a mud pit, but... Oh, dead possum, raccoon. Road hazard. Stop. Oh, shit. 
Okay, that was new gravel, but it... It's a marshy area. Stop ahead. Okay, am I turning? Am I not turning? Uh, or am I done? Hmm. The joys of figuring this stuff out. All right. I think I went too far. Or am I going straight? I'm going straight. Is this W? Oh, I don't know because I can't see and the roads aren't marked. All right, where am I at? Yep, this is W. Okay, so I need to go straight yet because we are not quite finished. Not quite finished of this section. So good to be back out on the bike. I just took a day today because I needed it. I needed some adventure. I needed some, I don't want to say it's relaxation because it almost feels like a game try to do this. And I think that's the challenge that I enjoy is trying to locate these roads because they're not always easy to find and completing them. So I think we are So I'm at a stop. Am I going straight? Am I turning? Let's see here. Cuz there's the bar. Is that the bar? <laughs> I think it is. And I think this is the end of it. So, not very well marked, but I like that the Wisconsin Department of Transportation um, has the website and then includes like the actual Google map route so it lays it out in red of the roads that are associated with it. So that helps me locate where I am on my map to figure it out. And so I can kind of put two and two together, piece the puzzle, and complete the route. I think this is the end of it now. Oh, no. Ooh, fun. Okay. Over a little bridge. More hills. Yes. Going up. <gasps> Kirby roads. Yeah. yeah. have good spots for their houses except I think in the winter time those hills would kind of scare me with the ice and the snow but not too bad some of them are quite brutal oh, man. now this feels more like nine miles felt so
so gypped when I got to that first end. It was like either my math is off or this can't be the end, I'm clearly. I should have done just a little bit more research, but I think it's more fun if you just go along for the ride and figure it out. But I have to say that first section of this rustic road in Fond du Lac County is probably my favorite of it. it kind of catches you off guard and you don't even realize it. All right, this I know for sure has to be the end of it. I feel confident that it is. Yeah, it is. Ooh, what was that? A stick hit my freaking wheel? Something hit my foot. The end. Sweet. Well, thanks guys for riding this one with me. It was quite the adventure, I have to say. But if you want to see any more of the rustic roads that I ride, um, feel free to follow along on this channel. I share these guys along with some of my normal motovlog content. Let's turn this guy in. Throughout the entire riding season. But I'm going to sign off for today. I was going to take another picture, but you kind of have to be... Like, you have to get the picture in while you can because this is the end of it, but there should be technically a sign right here as you're going into it for the route so you can take the picture. So I'm glad I did it when I did, or I'd have to go back just to validate that I was here to <laughs> ride the road. But, um, yeah, until next time, I'm going to see you guys very shortly here. And stay safe. See ya.